Ginyard did a great job defensively of taking on the shooter on the perimeter. And Hansbro, he may have to come out now if the officials think it's too much blood. But watch. Rebound the basketball is what you say in the huddle. Boom. There he took an elbow across the chops. Hansbro did. I don't know where Tyler's not bleeding for a while. But he thrives with blood on his mouth in a tie game. Danny Green missed his last free throw, but Carolina's 20 of 24, now 21 of 25 from the free throw line. Regardless of what happens here, Georgia Tech gets its hands on the ball. They're going to have a chance to tie, to send it to overtime, or a three would win it. And they have no timeouts. So they passed the test over Christmas on paper. Oh, boy. Can they do it now? Just call the play and let them go. They only need a two to upset the number one team in the country. Final 15 seconds. Causey guarded by Lawson. Looks to Morrow. Now down deep. Peacock drives. No foul call. Peacock got it back. Another shot. In and out. North Carolina's got the rebound. Last touch by Georgia Tech. Seconds remaining. Amido with those long arms will be the guy to try to put some pressure on Tyler Hansbrough's inbound pass. Uh -oh, and he stuck uh -oh. it. But the uh -oh. buzzer sounds and the game is over. What a ball game it was. North Carolina goes to 18 and 0. 3-0 in conference play. Georgia Tech falls to 7-9 and 0-3, but they certainly look much better than a 7-9 team tonight, didn't they? Number one, North Carolina 83, Georgia Tech 82 in a thriller at Alexander Memorial Coliseum.